Our game pause is a mix of animation and real life footage as well as interactive scenes. Originally our client, the Carnegie Mellon Human Computer Interaction Institute, tasked us with making a more conventional transformational game. However, as we worked with them and explored metaphor as a belief change strategy, we found that our research and our experiments in using metaphor were far more valuable both to them and to us. A lot of times games only use metaphors in sort of the game content, but if we're going to try to figure out design principles for transformational games, we need to understand metaphor much more carefully. So the game that we chose to make explores metaphor as a transformational strategy in the context of a game about human behavior after natural disasters. Essentially, we want to make a counter-narrative to the dominant media narrative that people after natural disasters behave brutally or are helpless victims. We wanted to show that people are good to each other, help each other, and help rebuild after a natural disaster. I wanted to explore this through games because games have an experiential quality. The game is meant to take place inside of a media player. So it has these elements that are very reminiscent of controls that people are familiar with. Uh, what we then did was kind of turn that on its head where the results of those interactions were unexpected. Uh, and, and we felt that we'd be able to use this as kind of a catalyst for a grander set of, of metaphors through the mechanics around the media's interpretation and the media's influence in the content that we were dealing with. For our project, we've also been the subject of research at the HCI department, and they've been studying our process because they're interested in how making a transformational game changes us as people and how we relate to the subject matter. And they're also interested in the techniques that we chose to use in the development of this game. By understanding the design process of this team creating transformational games, I expect to be able to make recommendations for other teams. What, uh, to what extent do they need to understand the literature? What kind of ideation process works? What kinds of tools can we give teams to create more successful transformational games? Uh, we are also delivering all the content we created to the HCI department. They will modify it and use it to test the effectiveness of metaphor as a transformational strategy. I'm really excited about what the team has discovered and um, I'm grateful to them for uncovering the assumptions that I had made in this project. Uh, I think it's going to be exceptionally productive for my research, both on how game design teams produce transformational games and to be able to cut apart this thing that they created uh, in order to, create, to help uh, create design principles for other transformational games to help them uh, do a better job using metaphor.